Hello friends, welcome to the Java Tricky Program series. So today we will look something interesting with simple date format class in Java. So here is a one simple program I have written where I am passing the date in this format and then I am converting it to date using simple date format parse method. And then I am just uh, reformatting it in some other way and printing it. So let's see what happens when we run this program. So we are getting the output date like this which includes date, minute, everything and then in the sec second one we are getting in this format. So everything looks good. There is no problem. But this is a valid date. Now what will happen if I say 32 January 2016 so will it throw exception some error what will happen so let's just run this program and find out so now if I'm running this program so it's printing 1st of February 2016 so the reason is whenever we are passing some invalid date like this where the numbers are not in the range for example for date the valid values are between 1 and 31 so what it does is it just take out that extra value and add it to the current date so this is one more than 31 so it will just add it to the 31st Feb January 2016 and that's why we are getting 1st of February 2016 so what will happen if it is like negative so let's say if it is minus one so in that case will it subtract it let's see so here it is printing 30th december 2000 30th december 2015 why because the 0 1 2 1 1 2016 will be January and then 0 and minus 1 so basically it is subtracting two dates so that's why from 1st January it is going to 30th December and then 2015 now let's see whether the same thing works with months also so we have let's say this is 13 so ideally since it is doing addition here in date it should be adding one month to 1 12 2016 and I then in that case it should print first January 2017 because that's what will be if I add one month to first December 2016 let's just find out so yes it is correct so it is printing 1st January 2017 now let's see what happens if we put it minus 1 so here again it should subtract 2 months from 1st of January 2016 so it will be 1st of November 2015 yeah now let's see what happens when we do the same thing with year so here I am saying minus 2016 so ideally it should be going to from AD to BC let's just find out so here as you can see that the AD changes to BC so basically it's like uh, minus 2000, 2017 years before AD so that is why it is printing BC so yeah I think that's all for this tutorial and uh, I hope you learned something new today because I, I have been using simple date format for so long and I got to know this thing like just some time back yeah Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.